My name's Mike Canestraro. My nickname's Can Man. And I'm Angela Canestraro. And we own Visions Tattoo Piercing and Art Gallery in Medway, Massachusetts. And this is our story. I'm a tattoo artist. I've been tattooing for close to 25 years now. We're a tattoo and piercing studio, um, and also we sell fine jewelry. We also aim more towards the artistic side of things as far as the tattoos and the piercings go. We're looking to do something more custom, so it's not something that you can just get at any other studio. Um, the artwork or the tattoos that people are getting done are based off their ideas, but we design for each person. It's more of a collaborative effort uh, between each of our clients because it's also their ideas, it's our expertise. I've been, in, I've been interested in art ever since I was, um, I, I like to say, I don't like to say big enough, I was small enough to fit behind my mother's couch and with the crayons right all over the walls. The way that I got interested in tattooing was uh, I got my first tattoo and I thought it was like, um, the lack of sound and tacky, a very magical experience, so to speak, uh, going into the studio, watching what everybody was doing. Also, it kind of dawned on me at that moment that this is like the probably the highest honor that you could receive as, a, as an artist to be having someone allowing you to put your art on them permanently on their skin. And I was very lucky to have a mutual friend of ours that uh, taught me how to pierce. Um, I am now the uh, manager. I handle all the back-end work. Um, now that we have grown the business, I have a full-time piercer, and so I have stepped back from that duty. So we both worked at a studio in Plymouth, and we commuted from here in Medway. So we worked together there, and we figured we both had a little experience working together and thought that maybe opening a studio would be a good choice. I already had a clientele here and we already had a, a base of people we knew so we thought that Medway would be the best spot to do it. I actually grew up here. Um, I uh, graduated from Medway High School. Um, pretty much been here my whole life. You know, being in a smaller town you're able to make a little bit closer connections with your with your clientele. What Ben speaks is, is uh, suicide prevention. Judy DiVangelo does um, a lot of work with, with younger children, with uh, schools, and tries to get the, the word out there on uh, helping uh, kids find a creative outlet and to, to really acknowledge um, what's going on within our society and with our young people and try to find more productive and um, positive ways in, in helping uh, these coping, the, in coping with uh, the hardships of just growing up, you know. And uh, so these events that she would put on, uh, she would pick one uh, individual that had, um, who had committed suicide and he would paint that individual during her concert. Mm -hmm. And once the event was finished, he would have already completed the portrait of that individual, which unbeknownst to uh, the person, he family. would actually, the, yeah, family, the family member, the he would go ahead and present it to them. Um, as a gift. The other thing that uh, that we'll do is uh, the outside the box. Those mm -hmm. are events that he'll host maybe once or twice a year and it is open and free to anyone. Um, so again we've had lots of people, uh, locals from around town that attend and basically they just come here, they can uh, meet other artists, uh, feed off of each other. They can work pretty much in any medium. It's not a, an instructional workshop or anything. It's just to try to get artists out of their workspace and um, to collaborate and just to collaborate with other artists yeah. and just have a fun day with it. We definitely have our sites down the road to kind of, um, not, not so much lead, but to kind of help facilitate and maybe kind of collaborate with other people to kind of build maybe a little bit stronger of an arts community in Medway. I'm Angela Canestraro. I'm Mike Canestraro, nicknamed Can Man. We are the owners of Visions Tattoo Piercing and Art Gallery. And that's our story. <laughs>